YouTube, today I'm going to show you my Sprint Air Rave. Right now I'm in my basement and it keeps on going from 1 bar of 1x to 0 bars. This is without the Air Rave on. I'm going to turn it on in a minute. Let's see, it's searching for signal. I doubt it's going to get anything. But uh, I'll wait a second. Alright, nothing's happening. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn on my Sprint Airy. I'm going to time how long it takes to turn on. And I'll get right back to you. Alright, I'm back YouTube. Here's the setup of the Sprint Airy. Got the Ethernet cable connected. The power cable over here. And then the GPS signal. And um, it connects a few devices. And let's go back over to the phone. And I have a full 5 bars 3G. In the same spot where I just had 0 bars. And let me call 611, do a quick test. And that's the um, signal that you're connected to the air wave. Welcome to Sprint, the now network. Para Espanol, más que cinco. And um, text messages send pretty quick. If you're calling about seven. And we're gonna do a quick speed test. And I'm pulling pretty quick data speeds. Uh, on a cellular d data network, I've never even seen this, this high speed, so... The air wave really is a good thing to have, especially if you do not have good coverage in your house. And that's that. Now I'm going to show you what happens when you disconnect the air wave. And I'll show you that I'm going to lose the call right away. Let me just go disconnect it. Hit call. And instantly I lost the call. And I dropped all my service. Let me see if I can get the call back. Again, this is horrible service in my basement, in my um, upstairs in my house. So I usually keep the air phone. And this is the iPhone 4S too, so supposedly it has a better signal than the iPhone 4. And obviously.